Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Hi with Ty. I'm Ty, and today we're gonna be trying out something new that even, I don't know, I don't even know what to expect. We're trying out the Breeze Mint Extra Strength Tablets. Now this, I believe, is a sample packet. If you see them in store, they are usually in like a container. This one is the Breeze Extra Strength Tablet Indica Strain. It's 20 milligrams per tablet, and there's only one tablet in here, although I'm feeling two. So, we'll see. I really like the back of the packaging. It does a comparison in the back of like when you smoke, how quickly that fizzles out as far as the high, and you know, versus the edible. Um, I really like the back of the packet. There's a little chart there giving the comparison of like the effect and time of the tablet versus smoking and it's from the chart it looks like it's trying to tell us that this edible will last a lot longer than just a smoke sesh. It says wait to one to two hours for full effect may last up to eight hours. Jesus Christ. Um, but okay. And then it says out of the recommended dose out of light, average, and heavy, this is considered a heavy dosage. So I consider my tolerance to be pretty sky high, especially at this point in time. A regular session with my bong is not really kicking, is not really kicking my ass. And it just feels like it's starting to weigh on my lungs. So I honestly either need to take a break or I need to turn to edibles. So Let's cut this bad boy open and see what waits us inside. All right, we're back with some scissors. We're gonna go ahead and cut the dotted line at the top of the package there. Although, just make sure, obviously, you can feel that your edibles are on the bottom away from the dotted line. All right, let's get this open, first impressions. Smells like I'm smelling flour, like literally right out the jar. That's very interesting. I'm actually kind of like tickled a little bit by that. That's funny. These are not bad. So this is what they look like. I'm gonna show you guys as best as I possibly can. They're tiny, tiny mint sizes with a B engraved on it. Although my camera's not picking that up. That's what they look like. They look like little Tic Tacs basically um and it says 20 milligrams per piece there's two in here so i'm honestly confused because the packaging even says one tablet um cheers we're, we're gonna do one and just see how we feel so we can do the review based off that let's go ahead for the taste i'm getting minty a little bit of peppermint not a lot mostly mint Other than that, it's pretty flavorless. Like a hint of bud, you know, like the aroma's there, but it's not like a heavy factor. And all those are just starting to intensify as it melts down, to be honest with you. Sorry, I get a little sour now, let's break it down. Not sour, but you're just tasting like bud, you know? I'm gonna water it down. That's the way to go. It's stuck in my teeth though. It kind of reminds me of like the Smarties candies as far as like it dissolving and breaking down in your mouth. It reminds me of the Smarties candies, especially when you would like chew a bunch of those under your molars and you would have the candy stuck in your teeth and you would just spend time digging that out with your tongue. That's kind of what that just reminded me of. But like the flavor just got worse as it started to break down. Obviously, I pretty much expected that it's a mint. I have a hard time with mints to begin with because they're, they just start off really harsh. But that didn't start off harsh. It started off harsh later on. So the aftertaste is definitely a no for me. Uh, but so far, so good. I'll see you guys in an hour. I don't think it takes about two hours for edibles to kick in for me, but if that's the case with this mint, this is gonna be a no for me. Honestly, in a time where fast acting edibles are actually fast acting and are available, this is not it. <laughs> 
I honestly think we should take advantage of the leisure that we do have instant gratification even with edibles in this day and age. And if it's kicking in in about two hours, it ain't it, honey. If it's saying the full effects in two hours, okay. But I would appreciate and hope that it's kicking in within like 30 to an hour, 30 minutes to an hour. Excuse me. But the packaging says otherwise. So I'll see you guys in about an hour, maybe two. Peace. Yeah, it's me. It's been an hour. I'm checking in. I don't feel anything. I don't even feel 10 milligrams worth of this um, mint. I'm gonna set an hour, another timer for an hour. So it'll be the two hour mark from when I took it and we'll see how I'm feeling then. All right, guys, we are 10 minutes into the second hour and I feel a little something, but it's not, um, it's not very strong. It's good. Seeds it for what it is, but uh, two hours is fucking crazy, bro. Two hours is crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. Obviously, this was a sample. If I was getting this by choice, I would have to time it and, you know, just make sure it kicks in right when I need it to. Otherwise, I'd, I'd be, you know, waking up high if, if I'm timing this at 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock, you know what I'm saying? 7 o'clock even. Um, so it's not really for me as far as like when it hits and the timing of that, that's a very long time, but it is a great quality. I feel good. I feel like this indica is great. Um, and I like the way I feel. I feel very relaxed, just calm, like calm, like again, Whew. I can either take a nap or I could, uh, just relax and chill. Yeah, it feels nice. I like it. It's good. It's not bad for what it is. It's just the duration, again, for it to kick in is too much. So, personally. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. I hope you have a good rest of your day. Please make sure to like and follow for more content like this headed your way. Peace.